All right, here we are, the beginning of our setup tour. We're starting off with Kanojo's side. Obviously, things are different than they used to be, but this is Kanojo's new setup. She has a massive monitor, some good-looking keyboard and mouse stuff there, and then her, her PC is right here. And uh, I don't know if I can get a good angle of what's going on inside, but it's clear and it's got like five fans and uh, Kanoj is really happy with it. She's playing The Sims, very cool. <laughs> and then over here, we got a PlayStation 4 controller. We got Lola's little bed that she uses. And uh, we also got my setup over here. And uh, my setup also recently changed because I didn't used to have this monitor here, but now I do. That used to be Kanojo's monitor. That used to be Kanojo's monitor, so now, uh, that's mine and uh, here's the mic that I use big W's got some Minecraft on this stream And then obviously my keyboard here. I think that I bought this keyboard I don't think this is the one that came with the PC I have the same mouse as Kanojo's though and then right here is my PC a beast of a PC right here uh, hopefully you can't figure out where I am just based off of that. And now it's time for the Q&A section of this video. Once again, thank you guys so much for 2,000 subscribers. Very you have much. no idea what this means to us. We did 2,000 subscribers and I think just under or just over a year of us starting this channel. So that that's that's crazy. Like, thank you guys. We love you, we appreciate you, and we're super sorry for not posting recently. We've been really busy, but I hope that this video comes to show you guys that we are not done, mm -hmm. and this is just the beginning, my friends. Yes, we are going to continue to to work on things and bring you more, more videos, more content, more streams. You're going to be very happy. We hope so. We'll see. But enough of that. Let's get into this. So question number one. We're starting with a big question. This was literally the first question that was asked in the Discord. Uh, all these questions, by the way, are from the Discord, so make sure you join the Discord if you're not already in there, so you can be a part of events like this. Uh, and I did not include questions that people asked either more than once, or if the same person asked two questions, I picked the first one you picked, or I, I wrote down the first one you sent, so that, Not I'm sorry true. if you don't see all the questions, but yeah. my goals in life, that's crazy, that's a crazy question because I got a lot of goals, so I'm going to let Kanoji go first. I want to be a farmer. I actually want to have a farm and I want to grow the things that, that I eat and I feel like that would be really cool and it would be really nice and like chill, but like it's hard work, but it's in like in a rewarding way. Fulfilling. Yes. It's fulfilling. And then my uh, another thing that I really, really want to do is I want to learn ice skating and I want to to actually like become decent at it. Wow, those so, yeah. are pretty good goals. Those yes. are, you know, I was thinking of goals that are not so straightforward. So I guess yeah. the yeah, first I'm thinking of a straightforward goals. The first goal that I guess I'd say I have is that I it, it's a goal that I have that I don't think I'll ever finish because uh, I believe in having goal. I have like different tiers. I have a tier list of goals pretty much, and the top of the tier list of goals are goals that are impossible to achieve because that way you never run out of things to do in life. So one of those goals for me is to make every single person in the world happy. And uh, obviously I can't do that, but I'm going to do my best and every day is another opportunity to make a new person happy. And uh, I guess for something that's less impossible uh my goal is to get uh karito kanojo to be like a massive youtube channel one day hopefully get to a million subscribers hopefully uh we have like massive server events and we have massive like parties and stuff like that would be really really cool and uh i'm excited for that i don't know if it'll have or ever happen but we'll try we'll see, we'll see. <laughs> all right but question number two let's see we got one story or two story house what'd you think i would i want a two story house i do not want a one story house if it come with an escalator, then I'm down with the two-story house. If no escalator or elevator, I'll take an elevator too. One-story house might be the one you're for me. No, no, you're so lazy. No, that's not happening. But you could have you a one-story house that's like huge. What if grandma comes over and grandma wants to then go sleep? Then you're just taking a lot of land for no reason when you can just build up. But what about grandma? Grandma We're, can't go take the stairs. We'll have a downstairs bedroom for grandma. And so grandma what? Grandma can only see half the house? Uh -huh. We can carry grandma upstairs to okay. give her a tour the first time. And good then luck, good luck carrying grandma. Oh Hopefully my god, drop her. You're so... Okay, question number three. Why did you guys decide to play Roblox? Of all games on this channel, 
Uh, I think I'll start with this one. So this is really funny, actually. So I hardly played Roblox before starting this YouTube channel. I played, obviously, like I knew what I was doing. I played Roblox. I played a bunch of different types of Roblox games, but it was mostly whenever I was hanging out with my friends because I never had a PC and I never had a phone. And then when I did get a phone, I was playing Call of Duty. And so I just like never really got super into it. Call of Duty and the phone. No, Call of Duty on PS4. But at the time, Roblox wasn't on PS4, so... But we were looking at games that we wanted to play together, and we were also talking about maybe starting a YouTube channel because we wanted something that we could do together that we would find fun. And so we were looking at, like, initially we were going to make a channel about anime content. And so we were going to do, like, anime reviews, and we were going to, like, do watch parties of animes and, like, react to the animes or whatever. And uh, when we were looking at anime content on YouTube, it looked really hard to do. <laughs> So we were like, you know what, maybe not that. And, but we knew that Roblox had a bunch of anime games, like Anime Adventures, which I had already been grinding a little bit. So we just decided, you know, let's do Anime Adventures and see where things go. And then all of you guys know Anime Adventures eventually got taken down. We played ACS, we played Block Streets, we played a bunch of games after that. And that's kind of how things rolled out. It wasn't exactly yeah. planned, but it happened. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna let Kanojo answer the question number four since I ha I kind of hogged question number three. So uh, why don't you play Fortnite anymore? Oh, honestly, I think this is a question for oh, you anyway. Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, oh. we never. And Lola came to say hi. I didn't never really play Fortnite like that. I am the one that I play it sometimes too, and it's mostly because I play it with people that actually like it. Like I, ne I rarely play go out of my way to play it unless I'm really excited about the. But the, they like, got abandoned. Event. They've abandoned us. The event that they have, because I'm not so much of a pew pew games kind of person. I'm more of a like cool effects or like cool powers and magic type of uh, type of person. And so I just I like the extra event powers that they have. So question number five says, when and where did you guys get Lola, and why did you get her? So we got Lola at a humanitarian center that's in North Miami Beach, uh, that's in South Florida, and. Uh, we got her December 18th of 2022. So we've had her for almost two entire years. Yeah. And the reason we got her, I guess that's a hard question for me to answer because I was not the one who wanted her. So I wanted a doggies. I really, really, really wanted a doggies and I had asked him many times to get me a doggies. But why'd you want her? Because I love doggies. I love animals. I love all animals. I want cats too, and I've been begging him for a cat as well. I'm allergic just, to cats. Yeah, and I and someday we will have a big enough house where that won't matter anymore. But that day is not today, sadly. Okay. There you go. Lola's also the cutest doggy in the world, so that's she a good is. reason. She is. That's why we ended up getting her, because she's so cute. Question number six. Why should I subscribe to the channel? Uh, I love that one of you literally asked this question, and the reason you should subscribe to this channel is because, uh, I don't know, is, should, should there be a reason? Shouldn't you just subscribe out of the kindness of your heart? Isn't that what good people- No, nah, I'm kidding. The reason you should subscribe is because Kanojo will, uh, attack you. With love. I got the Venezuelan fury inside me. Uh, guys, I don't know. I mean, to be honest with you, I couldn't tell you why you should subscribe. You should, you... you should subscribe because we try our best to entertain you guys, and we want to do our best to make things fun and people happy. Yeah. If you are entertained by us, if you like us, if you think maybe you just want to be nice and subscribe, those are reason good reasons to subscribe. Reasons not to subscribe would be you don't like us, you think we are stupid, and you don't get entertained at all and don't get anything out of our videos. I guess, you know, this is making me wonder why do I subscribe to anybody? Maybe I should just unsubscribe to everybody. Alright, question number seven. Why don't you try to play PvP games in Roblox or learn how to get better? Ha! No. Okay, uh, because I don't like PvP games. It's almost like asking someone why they don't, like, eat pasta. And they tell you it's because they don't like pasta. And you're like, but have you eaten it enough times? Have you tried enough pastas? And they're like, dude, I don't like pasta. And then they're like, but bro, have you tried this pasta from over here and this pasta from... And it's like, bro. Have you I tried learning like the pasta? Pasta. And so that's essentially how I feel about it. I just don't like it. Like, it's not... I, I don't think it's bad. I just... I don't wake up in the morning and be like, yes, I want a PvP. It's you know? not entertaining. I don't find it entertaining at all because, what, like, 
mostly most of those Roblox games are set up in which you're just fighting to fight. And that's not fun to me. I don't like any PvP games. I want games to either entertain me or make me happy and like have a good time, you know. And de-stress. Period. Question number eight. By the way, there's 18 questions. Totally should have said that before. Yeah. Question number eight said, what made you guys create the channel Gare Tokonojo? I feel like I kind of answered this before, but uh, it's essentially because Kanojo and I wanted something that we could do together, and we had some free time in the afternoons, and we wanted to do something fun. And, you know, it always seemed really cool to be a YouTuber. I've been watching YouTube for, I think, like 12 years or something like that, and so it just always seemed like something really cool, and I thought it's something that I could do. I also tried streaming, like, three years ago, and uh, I... It, it didn't go well because no one watched, but it made it. I still liked it. Like, it was still fun. So, I don't know. Tried it again, and it worked out. So, if you guys think you would like to do it, then you should definitely try it out. And if it doesn't work the first time, try again. Question number nine How did you guys meet and when? What are your goals? We said the goals one. I don't know why I left it in there, but where did we meet? We met at my house, my apartment. I, I broke in. Home. He broke in, he was trying to steal something from us, and I- It was an armed robbery. Him. That's not how we met. My- uh, blah, 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 blah. I was living in this, ha in this, like, apartment with some roommates, and they were out partying with them, and then they were having- They decided to have an after party at, that, at my place, at our, our place. It was a 9 p.m. after party, okay? So don't get ahead of yourselves. No, it wasn't 9 p.m. Okay, continue, and then... It wasn't at 10 p.m.? And then... And then... You were there, I saw you, we talked, we met Okay, Kanoja is so good at stories, I'm glad you guys <laughs> know so now. Bad. Now you know how we met. Yeah. Uh, question number 10. What did you do for a living before streaming? Uh, that's a funny question because I'm still doing it. Uh, streaming did not, I did not quit my job to stream. That would have been crazy and I hope that nobody ever does that mm -hmm. unless they are already making a ton of money because that would be crazy. So We would be homeless if I, we did that currently work as an accountant i work uh like with taxes and i do bookkeeping and i do like number stuff so i guess that i do all that that's pretty much what i do and uh that's the most amount of information i'm willing to give what do you do kanojo currently i'm doing nothing since we moved to orlando i've been looking for a job and i'm still in the process of finding a job Maybe but one day. i will get a job at i'm not very picky i'm not looking like in a specific industry so She's got in a bunch of jobs. She's had, she's worked as a substitute teacher. She worked at T-Mobile. She worked yeah. with a bunch of stuff. Question numero 11. It says, how do you feel about your friends knowing you have a YouTube channel? Uh, I don't really care. My friends are really cool. They don't judge me. And uh, I act just as stupid around them. I don't really care. They know, but... I mean, blah, 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 blah. they know, but I didn't feel as happy about it until we switched to minecraft a little cringe some of her friends thought it was but yeah that we were playing whatever it was, they were like isn't that a kid's thing I'd be like yeah I don't, what do you think i'm unk or something which hmm <laughs> maybe i am because question number 12 is why don't you watch skibbity toilets and the reason i, I don't watch the skibbity i'm not entertained it's the same reason as the reason I don't play the Roblox PvP. It's like asking me if I like to watch scary movies, and I say, no, I don't like scary movies. And you're like, but what about this scary movie? This scary I don't like it. I just don't like it. I'm not a fan of Skibbity Toilets. So number one, it's because I, they're not speaking. And so I have to think about what they're saying. And when I watch TV, I am not trying to think. I'm just trying to watch. And so when they make me think things, I just watch something else because I think a lot already. I think about a lot of things. And uh, number two, the reason is because it's all like a minute and a half or less. There's nothing to even watch. Like, why would I get so worked up over something that was one minute or three minutes long? Like, it doesn't matter that much. Even when I watch an hour and a half movie, I'm like, cool. Okay, question number 13. 
You want to answer that one before, actually? If you had to pick a superpower, what would it be? Oh, my God. I We've been this having question. this conversation so many times recently. So many times. So... My power would be the... I don't know the name. It's the power of this character from Hunter Hunter. His name is... Noth? Well, I think what's the power? It's a power to create, like, teleportation circles that go into, like, different rooms that he has in an alternate dimension. And, oh, and so kind of like teleport between those rooms to anywhere that he has been. So I think it's really cool because I I would use it a lot in re, in real life to not have to like drive to work. Okay. Uh, so this is a big question, guys. If we're living in a world where everyone has superpowers and it's not weird to have superpowers, I'd probably pick. Well, actually, you know what? I think I picked the same power either way. Even if nobody had superpowers, I was the only one, I would pick ultrasonic speed. Like, the ability to move at the speed of light. Because if I can move at the speed of light, I can essentially teleport, but I'm not just teleporting, because I'm also, like, slowing time down by moving so fast. So for me, time is going really slow. And uh, that sounds really cool. It's like three powers in one. I get to be really fast, I get to teleport, and I get to change the way time moves. So Basically. That's my power. To a certain degree. Okay, question 14. Is Konojo gonna make Kare go bald? Never. She cares about my hair. As a matter of fact, I want him to grow his hair long, and he refuses to. No. He continuously asks me to cut it short, and I want him to grow it, like, very long. Okay, question number 15. We got three left after this. Did, Did you, go to, you go to college? Did you go to college, Kanojo? I went. I didn't finish it. I did go to college. That's it. <laughs> and finished it. I don't know if you want some he type. He finished of, it. I don't know if you want some type of opinion from me, but uh, I won't provide. I won't provide my opinion on whether or not you should go to college. I went to Florida State University, though. Uh, question sixteen: Have you ever thought about quitting YouTube and focusing on work? Kanojo actually did think of that and followed through. Yeah. Kinda. I'm still here right now. So yeah, I'm still gonna be around. It's just gonna be a bit less. She's trying to focus on some other stuff right now. Personal development and all. And uh, I have... I mean, I think about a lot of stuff. I have thought about quitting YouTube, but like, I don't... It's not like I have to quit it, you know? Like, I can just take a month off if I need to. If there's times where we get busy in life and... I hope you guys understand that I'm not able to work a full-time job and also produce content every single day. Uh, we used to be able to do that like a year ago. Things are changing, but you know. Yeah. Uh, I definitely don't think I'd be quitting. Like, I, I, There might be times where I take breaks just because I have to work on stuff or I have things going on in my life, but I love doing YouTube. I love streaming and I love posting videos. I love making videos. It's a lot of fun, honestly. And. Um, yeah, I, I also don't like my, my work in general, so there's nothing to focus on. <laughs> All right, <laughs> question 17. Will you ever stop being a scooty yunk? No! Never! Okay. All right, so we're on to the last question, which is question number 18. Uh, what an insanely good question. You know, I honestly, I just put them in the order that they came with, but uh, what came first, the chicken or the egg? I actually know the answer to this, so I'll let Kanojo go first. The. Okay, I guess that's her answer. Uh, the egg came first because dinosaurs laid eggs and chickens were not around when the dinosaurs were around. And it's not saying, is it a chicken egg? So, therefore, eggs came first, chickens came millions of years later. Easy win. I hope you guys enjoyed the that video. That is actually the best answer I've ever heard for that. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Catch you in the future, boys. There's going to be more stuff soon. And Konojo is super cool. She might not be here for the future content, but we love her and we miss her. And she'll still be around. So we look forward to seeing you guys in the future streams and videos. And until then, Bye. peace.